I think we're about to get abducted by aliens. <gasps> Whoa! That's really fast! This map mod is the long road. It brings the long drive to BeamNG. We have to drive from one side of this massive map to the other to see our mother's house. Now, I'm going to be using a VW Beetle mod for this because you can drive one of these in the long drive. And the long drive is a randomly generated, like, endless driving game. This map is 16 kilometers squared. It's by Spieler. It's available on their Patreon now. It's a brand new map, but don't worry, it will be coming to the repo for free very soon. So I've got this Beetle, this customized Beetle, a very powerful car. We've got to drive around 16 kilometers squared of map to get to the other side to see Mom. Oh, yeah, here we go. So I've got my GPS on. This is going to be awesome. I'll leave a link to this Beetle mod in the description as well as the map mod. And when it's available for free on the repo, I'll update the description with the link. Whoa, this thing is very, very fast. So, Spieler, uh, who used to be called Spencer Johnson, has created this awesome map inspired by... Whoa, break! No, no, no! Ooh! Inspired by the long drive, that awesome driving game. Uh, this is a map mod that was commissioned by Komodo Gaming. This map has so many custom sounds and Easter eggs and even a rainy version of this map, which you can drive around. It's raining. The, whoa, the tarmac is very slippy. And if you want to see me drive on that, why not let me know in the comments? Here we go. This thing is epic. I love this Beetle so much. It's a very powerful variant. And look, we've even got our luggage on the back to go and see our mother's house. We're going to be staying the night, I guess. Whoa! Oh my goodness. I can't wait to get to the desert because there's some really cool easter eggs in there. Let's see what we can find. Now this map has both AI support and a beautiful nighttime mode. We'll be trying the nighttime mode later, but as you can see, the AI are actually driving pretty well. It's quite a wide road. They're kind of avoiding me and, you know, not getting in my way. Whoa, look at this tower. That's one of the first big buildings we've seen. Anything up there? Let's have a quick look. That's like a, a kind of a watchtower. But from here, you can actually see right over the map. There's the next biome, the desert, and then another, and then the Arctic region. Oh my goodness. I haven't seen too many buildings yet. I'm just wondering if there's something around here. Oh, what's that down on the left there? I can see something over there. Whoa! Break, break, break! Aha! A dirt path. Let's go down it. Oh wow, there's like a massive building on there, like a gothic mansion or something? Yeah, awesome. I hope it's not too spooky. Oh no. <laughs> oh no, whoa! Oh, well, there's somebody driving away from it. Maybe they got scared and started to flee. Well, they're not going very fast, are they? Whoa, come on, Beetle. Yeah, rally car Beetle. Awesome. I love it in this red as well. Oh, my goodness. Here we are at the mansion. What is that in the front garden? Oh, that's creepy. Can you hear that? So, unfortunately, you can't go in, but that is a really spooky mansion. In fact, there is a door here. What's at the door? Hello? Hello? Anybody there? No, nobody's there. But it is very spooky. Okay, we're back on the road, and as you can see, the grass is kind of turning colour very slowly as we head towards the desert. So we're going to do like a speed run now down this hill. Whoa, watch out, AI. We're going down the hill. Fourth gear. This thing goes 125 miles per hour. It's pretty quick for a beetle. And our luggage is still intact, which is good. I wonder how quickly we're going to drain the fuel at this speed, though. There might be a fuel station on the way we can fill up at. But we've certainly got a long way to go. Right, here we go, into the desert. This, I think, would be a good place to turn on the nighttime mode if we don't lose control. Yes, into the desert. Here we go. So, Spieler really does create some awesome nighttime modes in his map. So, nighttime, there we go. Look at that. The sky is just absolutely beautiful. Look at that. You can see like galaxies and stars. It's great. Uh, the lights on. There we go. I'm going to put the high beams on. For some reason, this car's engine is really cool. I don't know why. Usually, beetles would get hot, wouldn't they? Because they're like air-cooled. Anyway, especially in the desert. Look at that rock. That kind of massive rock face there. Whoa! Here we go! Although, to be honest, we're going to play the rest of this map in the afternoon. Here we go. So we're driving out through the desert. The desert is a huge area. It really does look good, too. Whoa, whoa. Look out, everyone. Look out. There we go. Beetle coming through. Oh, there's like a ghost town over here. Maybe a derelict mining village from the gold rush. Whoa, watch out, man. Goodness me. Some of the AI drivers are terrible, but most of them are pretty good. I guess like real life, like real life drivers. Aha! 
There's a gas station. Well, luckily we don't need any gas. I may actually even have infinite gas or something on. But this uh, beetle isn't very thirsty. No, the, the fuel is going down a bit. Um, what can we buy? It's probably because I'm resetting it resets the fuel. No, we don't need any fuel anyway. Oh, what's down here? Whoa, watch out. Can you let me cross? There you go. What's down here? What could possibly be down this little road? A lot of cactuses or cacti. Oh! Oh! There's a... Aliens! Oh no! We're trapped! A crashed alien ship. Oh, what's inside? Nothing. Thank goodness. Where's this guy going? Where's... What the heck is this guy doing? Is it an alien? There's more! Does it... Does it attract cars? I think it might attract cars. That's kind of cool. What is going on right now? What the... <laughs> what? Look at all this over here. So much more land to explore. It's crazy. Watch out, everybody. My briefcase is going to fall off the back. No, my luggage. No. Oh, it's hanging on. Oh, dear. It's gone. Whoa. What's that over there? Can you see it? That's a spaceship. The aliens really are here. Right, let's go and have a look. Oh, I can hear it. Look at it over there. I've got my luggage back. I don't want it to miss this experience. This thing is pretty good off-road, which is good. Good thing we've got the, uh, the sunroof open so we can see what we're looking at. Wow, look at it up there. That's craziness. Look at it! Glowing green as well. This must be a custom asset. I don't think that... Is there a spaceship in Vanilla Beam NG, one of the maps? And it's so loud as well. Look at it! Right. Where... Ha oh! Oh! Can we get abducted by aliens? I think we're about to get abducted by aliens! <gasps> Whoa! That's really fast! Oh my... They over... We overshot the aliens! We're now falling. Um... It's a long way down! Oh dear. Jeez. Let's try that again. Come on. That is an awesome Easter egg there. This is probably the best Easter egg so far. Better than the creepy mansion, that's for sure. Right, where is it? Very hard to look up, isn't it? Here we go. If we go nice and slow, we won't overshoot it, right? Really slow. Whoa! Jeez! That's crazy. What? They're all being abducted. All the vehicles are being abducted. What's going on? When you go into that thing, it changes the gravity for the whole map. Right, okay. <laughs> Look at them all going up. That's funny. Oh, it's raining cars. It's raining cars. Because they're all being dropped down. That's funny. Look at this landscape. It looks great. Whoa! Oh, I spent too long looking at the landscape. Damn it. Yeah, I do that a lot be a great landscape and it looks like before we leave the desert we've got to go through an abandoned city awesome so what kind of i don't know this looks like wally doesn't it like the the world from wally has this just been completely abandoned for ages has there been a, a nuclear explosion or something that's craziness crane there i don't know what the crane's doing wow so you could have a good look around this city there's a de derelict truck over there smashed windows oh can you go inside any of the buildings? Maybe you can a little bit. Yeah, that's great. Well, we're just about exiting the desert now. What's next on our long journey? Okay, we're out of the desert and we're back into these plains. There's like, oh, I can see on the hill there. That's the Arctic region, the last bit we'll be going to today. Whoa, before mom's house. Oh my goodness. So the luggage has fallen off a few times, but we've always got it back, which is good. Whoa, what is that on the right there? You see that? Oh. Is it a... It's a crashed plane. Whoa. Stop, 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 stop. There's a massive crater where it's landed. Whoa. It's a huge plane. Look at that. Like a... I don't know. A 767? Something like that? Something airlines. Dowie? Bowie airlines? Look, you can see the seats in there. Oh. That's amazing. Yeah. So a, a big plane crash as well. And then a jet engine there. Wow. What's going to be next? Oh, I see a building on the hilltop there. Yep, like a derelict building here. It looks like you can actually go in. 
which is pretty cool. Let's have a quick look. It's so grimy in here. What the heck? Ah! Um, well, I didn't expect to see that. That is, I think, what they call the dingus cat. But I'm not very up on memes. I could be wrong. No, that's the only Easter egg in that house. But that's really cool. The dingus cat. That's funny. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, back on the road, there are lots of those little buildings all dotted around the map that you can go and explore. And maybe you can, you'll find some Easter eggs of your own that no one else has found yet because there must be 100 or 200 Easter eggs in this map. It's craziness. Okay, we're in the Arctic region now. This is where it gets a little bit more difficult. Is the road a little bit icy? Mm, it feels a little... Mm, no, it don't... Oh, yeah, maybe. Maybe it is. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, so... Can we make it to Mum's house? It's the final stretch. Here we go. In fact, yeah, look, if I floor it and then wheel spin, look at that. It's very slippy. Yeah, it's very difficult up here. But we're climbing now, climbing up to the top of this massive mountain, and then we're going to loop around, and I guess that's where our mum lives. Look, another building. I'm not sure if you can explore that one, but there's a lot of details being put into this map. Well, the Beetle, obviously, it's an amazing mod. Is it the best car to drive on this map? I'm not sure, because it's got a very bouncy suspension. You want something that's got a very good suspension, maybe like a Rally car, a Rochi Sunburst, or a Sherry A Vivace, you know, something like that. Whoa! Oh, dear. Oh, dear. No! Our luggage again! Damn it. Wow, the hills here are pretty steep. I mean, this car has a lot of power, but not much grip, so come on! Oh, no. This, this hill over here looks even steeper. Oh, what's that there? A little, a little shelter someone's erected, so you can just get in there and hide from the snowstorms, I guess. Here we go. One of the steepest hills on the map so far. And it's difficult because of how slippy it is. Come on. Come on. Go, go, go. Yes, easy. Maybe it is a beast, even with its floppy suspension. Brake, 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 brake. It's so hard to brake on this surface. Oh, but the beetle looks okay. We could probably keep going. Oh, I can see bits of that other car flying everywhere. Sorry. Run away, run away. Go to mum's house. Come on. We're so close now, I can feel it. Right, here we go. Top speed run in the Arctic. We're going to get there. Come on. This thing is really good over 100. It's not that bad. The suspension seems to get firmer the higher speed you go. Oh, Fred the Needle. Come on. Come on. Yeah, get out of the way. He knows. He knows there's a beetle coming. Here we go. Oh. What's this up here? A massive rock and I can see a house. Is this it? Watch out, watch out, whoa! He's trying to stop us getting to our mum's house. Oh, yes. Oh, we got here, yes! Woo! Awesome, mum's house. Let's go and park up. Wait, what? Oh, no. Are you kidding me? No! RIP mum, 1968 to 2023. Oh my goodness, wow. Spencer tricked me. I thought we were actually going to see our mum, but no. She's in a grave. Oh, no. Well, that is The Long Road, an awesome map by Spieler that you can go and download on his Patreon. It will be coming up for free on the repo soon. I will leave links in the description for you to go and check out, as well as that Beetle mod. Now, if you want to see me play the rainy version or just, you know, try this map again, let me know in the comments and make sure to like this video. I've got lots more BeamNG coming soon, but if you want to see another BeamNG video, then click the link on screen right now. I think you enjoyed it. It's another map mod by Spieler. Thank you very much for watching, that's all for now, and I'll see you soon for some more Simulator Adventures.